fly, baby. It's a bent rod, bud. It's bent in half. Feel some weight screaming today. Fly tundra. Let's see. Let's smile one more time. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> What's going on, guys? I am still out of commission. That's right. I'm still cast it up. This is uh, for movement of my hand. That's uh, that's all I got. It's way better than it was before. I could even touch my fingers together. I'm on the second finger, and the third one is almost there, not quite. So we're on the long road to recovery for some physio for uh, tying flies and fly fishing in general. But uh, like I said, it could be a lot worse. So today, since I can't tie flies yet because I'm not allowed to and my hand is too sore to do anything with it, I'm basically one-handed, one-handed wonder. Woohoo! I decided to, since it's Thursday, to do a uh, Throwback Thursday episode. So this is some footage I did from last year. It's kind of been peaked here and there. But I've been playing with it now that I know a little bit more about editing and uh, working with some different programs. So I put together the best uh, video that I could. Throwback Thursday from last summer fishing uh, koi uh, in a private pond with my good friend Ryan Mentions. Big shout out to Ryan. It was an epic day. Uh, I caught uh, gold koi, orange koi, white koi, Amir koi. It was an absolutely amazing day. I'm hoping to get it again uh, this summer at the same place once I get uh, healed up and uh, maybe take two people at the most. It's kind of a small pond and it's kind of, it's probably private property. So maybe two or three people tops. Anyways, so look forward to that this summer, sometime this summer, later on, probably July, I guess, or August. So here is my Throwback Thursday Koi edition, memories looking back of uh, times of fishing. Welcome to our show of Tailors and Chasers. There I am at my secret carp spot or koi pot. I found a koi pond, and they're uh, they're pretty big, but uh, they're hard to catch, man. I thought it'd be easy because there's like never seen a fluor before ever, but uh, I've already missed three. Three have missed my actual fly. Um, I thought dry flies would be great because they're here sucking surface, but as soon as I didn't see it throw any food out, they uh, they stopped coming over. So I'm trying to get them to come back over again. What's going on? I'm still at the koi pond. Finally got a big boy. Orange one. On the fly, baby. It's a bent rod, bud. It's <laughs> bent in half. Feel some way screaming today. Black and orange. I love it. Let's cut him up, Scotty. Show, show the people what we're doing. Oh, yeah. Look at that gold, baby. Black tip tail. I love it. There, bro. Ready for the net? Ready for the net? You know what? Here, watch. I'll even get the net job on camera. That's how good I am. Look, this is what we need right here, ladies and gents. Here, watch. Ready? That's it, right there. Oh, yeah. Freaking out. Hey Scotty boy, is that your first uh, over five pound? It's my first koi. Like, I caught gold before, but not koi. Like this big before. So uh, this is uh, probably a five pounder. Let's see. Let's smile one more time. <laughs> yeah, baby! <laughs> yeah, baby! <laughs> this little guy. He usually is a lot more louder this, during this time. But look at this. Time, look, at this, this look at this. Come on. Look at this sexy fish. It's a mirror. Look at this. Look at this thing. Black tipped. Black on top. Black. Some weight on the other side. All right, I think she's ready for a release there, brother. I'm gonna put it in that. I'm gonna put it this way. Uh, sexy way. The old gentle release. Yeah. It's a, yeah. Thanks, thanks, Beauty. I love it. Yes, 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 yes! Woo! 
What do you, uh, what do you got there? I finally got the white one, baby. <laughs> hey, if it's white, it's all right. That's what we say. Yeah, yeah baby. Look at this thing, man. This is the sexiest thing ever I've ever seen. The white. You know, if the orange were cool, the white one's better. This is awesome. I love it. I've never seen a white guy catch white fish. <laughs> Me either. <laughs> He's whiter than I am. I got more tan than he does. <laughs> yeah, right. Right? <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah. Yeah. Tailwind. Yeah, Anyways. Yeah. All right. Yeah, baby. Tailies and chasers. Put me on a secret koi pond. Big old double header. Put it on the ground. First cast. Double header. There you go. Double header. Goldfish. I got a goldfish. And he's got a koi. Nice, eh? I love it. I love it. Eating the what? Snozberry. Let's see the see what lure there is in there. Hold it right up to the camera for me. Some good old snozberry. Those snozberries taste like snozberries. <laughs> I had to just put a name. I'm not yeah. gonna lie. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Drop. Oh. Can you not hold the fish? I don't really, yeah, Somebody need to teach you? I'm tired. I got a lot today. Yeah. <laughs> this thing, man. Yeah, baby. Right. Look at this thing. Black on um, black nostrils. This is, awesome. <laughs> this is awesome. This is the best one. This has got to be like, I don't know, seven, eight pounds. I don't know. It's kind of heavy, you know? Look at those rubber lips. Look at those golden and pretty lips, baby. <laughs> We're going to do the... Yeah, this is a big one. This is a bridge stock. Far the champ, man. I think I have a big nut today. Mm -hmm. Longer handle. Okay. Right, so. Sorry, te technical difficulties by uh, first day. Scott here. There he goes. Boom! <laughs> awesome. <laughs> slimage. Right, slimage. That's my uh, number eight koi today for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, you, you got me beat. You got me beat. You got me beat. Well, I hope you enjoyed the Throwback Thursday uh, Koi Pond edition. Uh, it was an awesome day. Call out a fish. I don't know how many landed. I think it was eight or something like that. Ryan got two. I got the biggest one and the prettiest ones and the most variety of ones. White one, orange one, orange and black. The mirror koi was definitely the highlight of the day. Getting one in general. I was surprised how hard they were to catch. They were, they were hard. They're in a pond. I figured it was easy. But uh, we got them on dry fly, which is even more, even more cooler. Dry fly nymphs and dry fly uh, mulberry flies. And uh, nothing on crayfish, it's all nymphs, nymphs flies or, or dry flies. Majority were caught on dry flies, believe it or not. I think because a lot of people feed them there and uh, they come for the food. So dry flies is kind of mimicking whatever they're throwing in their seeds or bread or whatever. Anyways, it was amazing. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for everybody for support. Thanks for watching. Hit that like button and, and hit that subscribe button if you really enjoyed this video. I'm Taylor Chasers. Thanks for watching. I'm out.